Eagles line drive left field line fair ball. Well Canzone can cruise home. Foppy will put on the brakes at third. It's a double for Cowles that produces the first run of the game. It's one to nothing Ohio State. Well there's the aspect of wanting to get ahead of the batters but then being predictable and putting the ball on the tee and right now Ben Dragani these young men are seeing his pitches extremely well three consecutive pitches hit hard Canzone goes back to tag no real need to do so and he's able to labor to get home to score the first run for the Buckeyes since vacated as we try to stay dry this is hit well to right off the bat of Coolin going back and that ball is out of here Bo Coolin with a solo jack to make it three to one Ohio State and it is the first home run of the season for the senior from Honolulu Hawaii Coolin amped up and justifiably so absolutely hammers this first offering from Weisenberger really no chance at all for Lewis out in right field ball just goes right above the yellow line at the top of the wall good balance swing home run swing finishes high oh cool with his first home run of the season on this stage ninth pitch of the at bat he is going and this ball is hit well to left center field there is some anger taken out from Brent Spillane he busts out of the slump in a big way with a three run bomb his 23rd home run of the season a no doubter the more pitches he sees from a pitcher in a bat the more dangerous he gets he finally got a mistake in got those hands extended that ball was a missile. What makes this impressive? It's to the right of that 375 side. <laughs> Not many have gone out in those al in between those alleys. And when the ball left the bat, all you heard was "Wow" from the crowd. A courtesy jog by Cleeth in center field. He knew that he wasn't going to go get that baseball. It's all about him right now. I think he found the camera over in the third base dugout. Oh, to be young again. <laughs> two down, two two pitch. Out to right field, pretty well struck. Yadowitz going back, still going. We are tied. Logan Kalitha with an opposite field home run is eighth of the season. Brand new ball game, 4-4 in the top of the seven. That was a heck of a swing. Don't know if you can credit the rally sunglasses, but this was an elevated pitch. Kalitha goes with it. Generates some backspin and that launch angle. It carries right on up, right on out of here. Yalowitz kept going back and back, but look at that swing. Not the best catch there behind the wall. And the celebrations from the Sunglass crew. We've now had three home runs in this game. Checks, kicks, deals. Hit in the air to center. Going back. Khalifa still going, reaches up. He didn't get it. He can't come up with a baseball around third. Jack Yanowitz, and it's a walk-off winner for the Illinois Fighting Illini. Five to four. Ben Troike delivers the winning hit. And Indiana will go home. Illinois stays in Omaha with a victory. Troy gets this ball deep, and with the Indiana infield playing shallow to cut off that run, it was a great effort by Kalitha, but it just hits off the end of his glove. It's a great try, but excellent execution by Troy Key to drive that run in. First walk-off 
win of the season for Illinois, and they get victory number 33 as Indiana slides to 38 and 17. And what a year it's been for Ben Troike, and the story continues. Brent Spillane was left in the on-deck circle. Turns out Illinois didn't need him to win it in the bottom of the ninth. Was a great effort by Kalitha. Let's get another look. Troike puts a charge into it. Kalitha was playing in. And he had to cover a lot of ground. Watch this effort just off the end of his glove. And once he's on the ground and the ball, there's no way because Yalowitz sees it's down. Going to score easily. Off the bat, it almost looked like Troike was frustrated that he thought that ball was going to be caught in center field. But he flips his bat. Ball kept carrying. And then the celebration. And the mob scene. Five to four, Illinois. So we've had ten games in this tournament. Five of them now have been decided by one run. We've had four walk-offs. Parity all around. Will the Illini earn a date with the Purdue Boilermakers?